Hey YouTube, Power Rangers Lego here with a with a video on how to draw. It is me, Multimon, at your service. Anybody want lunch? <laughs> Another one? What are they? Oh, allow me to introduce myself. My friends call me Multimon. Everyone does actually. Yes, today's video is on how to draw Montimon, so so far we have drawn number day one Coromon and day two Cinnamon. So today is day three, Montimon. Need a new bit of paper and we'll just start drawing straight away. So Montimon reminds me of a kind of Pac-Man. So that's basic shape you want to draw is a is just a Pac-Man shape. Okay, it is a bit squinty, but we'll fix that later. And about halfway, you could say halfway through the drawing, you're gonna draw two wee oval shapes. Like this. That could be changed later, but that's a rough idea. So let's start adding in the detail. So here is Montemon. Um, these two ovals here are Montemon's arms. One's, this one here is going to be in the foreground, this is going to be in the background. This is body. So we'll start drawing in the shape of Montemon. So Montemon has a big head and it turns into a kind of squid frilly bit at the bottom and he's also got his wee stubbly fingers if you want a video on how to draw them leave that in the comment but here goes the shape of Montemon so that's the sort of shape that you end up with after doing this I'll rub out the lines and then you'll get to see what it really looks like. After you rub out the lines, this is the shape you're left with. So, my Montemon's facing this sort of direction. So, wooden arms forward and he's kind of tilting his head. So now to draw on the eyes. Montemon's got really big eyes. Um, each eye is probably a fifth of the length. So if you divide the head up in five, then you get Montemon's head. So I'll draw in where Montemon's eyes would go. So I don't know if you can see, but this line here, and there's one here, one here, and one here. So there where Montemon's eyes would go. And obviously, because of the way he was facing, his pupils would be facing this way as well. So now, just draw in the eyes. There's a sort of idea where Montemon's eyes would go. Now to draw the mouth. The mouth is a, it's kind of like Cinnamon's mouth. It's got the, the W. But below the W is kind of U, because the mouth's open and you can see his tongue, so just draw that in, it's just bigger than the space in between his eyes. So this is what you end up with after you draw in the mouth. So, I think that's all the detail you need, you might want a wee bit more. I'll add in, add in the detail and then we can start drawing colour them in. So here is Montemon, time to colour them in. Um, the whole body is a darker pink than Zon Coromon. Uh, his fingers here and these parts of his eyes are really dark brown. This, these parts here are black, highlights white, um, red obviously. Don't colour in any of the black just now and we'll start with the colours.
So after you've coloured them in, this is what you end up with. Um, the pink I used was a wee bit strong, so I've added in a bit of peak. Kind of pale it down a wee bit. So now we need to do the black, but I'm not going to use the black pen to colour in the mouth and the eyes because that would just be a waste of ink. I'm going to use the black pen to do the outline of it. So I'm going to do the mouth and eyes first, and then I'll do the black outline. So this is what you end up after going out around it in black pen and all that. But uh, I have to recommend to anyone who is going to do Monty Mon that you do not colour him in with the pink. I think you're much better with paint. Colour him, paint him. So there, this is Monty Mon Day 3. Tomorrow we've got Yokumon. So, this is Power Rangers Lego, signing out.